Gen or 9 is new, it's what I'm used to when I'm using the web to navigate other software packages. I just love it. My name is Carol Wilson and I'm the Business Systems Analyst at UNC Wilmington in North Carolina. My users don't have to know the banner E's, the seven digit characters for the document names. They can type in banner finance journal entries and find the form. They can type in just journal and it'll bring a drop down. So I, I love that aspect. Banner 9 will help our institution with the goals of integrating other systems with Banner. We currently use SciQuest and we're preparing to use Chrome River and those implementations will be able to be extended functionality with the fact that we do have that extensibility in Banner 9. When UNCW looked at Banner 9 Finance and the testing aspect, I wanted to make sure that my users were comfortable with every single form that they use in Banner Finance. I also pulled in finance users on the campus to help me with beta testing different types of the functionality that they would use. That got me buy-in from all of my various areas. I had someone from every division before we released it to the campus to test. And that just really helped with the buy-in and promoting it and getting excited about it on campus. The one piece of advice I would give to someone that's considering Banner 9 administrative finance is to get it loaded, test it, and implement it. Don't be scared of it. It's not scary. It's going to make your life so much easier because your functional users and your campus users are going to easily adopt it. It's what they use when they're going anywhere on the web, when they're using any other software package. They're familiar with that type of navigation. I'd say go for it.